Today's topic is to generate the random strings until a given string is generated. So first we are going to initialize our library. That is first we are going to import our libraries. That is import string and import a random. After that we are going to initialize all of the elements which we need. So first we are going to initialize our elements. The elements which we are going to have them and the random which is going to store them so the elements it consists of the ac lowercase and to the c uppercase right now i've just taken up to the uppercase and the lowercase if you need to to add the digits and the special characters then you can add it by a plus and string dot digits like that and if you need to add any special characters then you can add it like plus and in the single quotes you can add all of the special characters which you need to add after that I've initialized our string one which is a given string I need this string and the current attempt the current attempt is going to store the attempts which the computer is going to make out of the random choices which is over here and the elements and it's going to join them together and I've taken the for loop over here the for loop this is just going to make those attempts up to the length of our string one and the complete over here which is going to be the false because it hasn't completed and the iterations since we are going to go through the iterations like after how many number of attempts the computer has made we have given an output our given string which was our given string and after that we are going to have an another loop and here over here we have used a while loop that is up till the completion gets to be the true the loop is going to go through we are going to print our current attempt over here that is we can see that how many attempts the computer has made and the next attempt over here is always going to be an empty string over here after that we have taken that the completion is true and after that we have taken another for loop over here which is going to go through the uh, length of our string I mean the range of the length of our string after we are comparing it if our current attempt is not equal to our given string over here then the completion is false and we are again creating a next attempt over here using the random dot choice and the elements which we need to take and else if it is equals to the similar then we next attempt is equals to the string one and we are incrementing the iterations after that and we are saving those next attempt into the current attempt and we are having an output now let me show you let's see uh, since our string is the uh, a b and both the lower characters so as you can see this many number of attempts the computer has made after it has made an ab which is our given string so after 81 attempts the computer was able to generate our given string